Okay, with this cold, your HVAC system might be working overtime. First alert meteorologist Cruz Medina tells us how to winterize your crawl space for optimal heating this winter. There are ways to make your home more comfortable during the winter that may save you money at the same time. A lot of this begins in your crawl space. It's cold now and temperatures will continue to fall on average in the coming months. Cold temperatures can have negative impacts on your crawl space like making your floors cold, lowering air quality, increasing your heating bill and increasing moisture buildup that can lead to mold growth. The stack effect, a phenomenon that occurs when there are differences between the inside and outside temperatures, can impact your home's energy efficiency, especially in the winter. As warm air in the home rises, there are cracks for it to escape through. That'll create a vacuum that draws in cold air from the crawl space and releases it into your home. This cold air can cause your heat to kick on more often, increasing your electricity bill. Here are some steps you can take to winterize your crawl space this winter. Control liquid water sources in the crawl space. This includes fixing any leaks and assuring proper temperature and humidity profiles to prevent condensation. Seal any vents or openings to keep the outside air from coming in. Encapsulate the floor and walls of the crawl space to create a moisture barrier between the ground and the crawl space. Lastly, make sure that your crawl space is well insulated. This includes insulating the walls and the rim joists, which tend to be the areas closest to the outdoor air and dirt. Following these steps to winterize your crawl space can save you money and keep your house warm this winter. Meteorologist Cruz Medina, WSMV4.